Welcome, welcome, welcome to yet again another edition of Blacks in Motion right here at BVN at 8. And as always, you still haven't been able to get rid of me, it's Cliff. And I'm here to bring you the hottest news in sports. And on this week's segment, I'm going to be talking the NBA. A little on-the-court drama and a little off-the-court drama. That's right, there's always a scandal going on in the NBA. Now go ahead and tend into this on-the-court drama, I want to talk about the Kevin Love saga. Look, he's a highly sought-after not quite free agent just yet. You know, he has one deal, one year left on his deal in Minnesota, and he's already told them, look, I'm done. I want out. So what do teams do in that situation? They look for a great trade scenario to get some assets back from another team or two, and they get to trade away their superstar before he becomes a free agent and they get nothing out of the deal. Now, the problem with Kevin Love, as soon as LeBron announced that he was going home, he was going back to Cleveland, he thought, hey, I need another superstar to come down here and play with me in Cleveland. And who should that be? Hey, I want Kevin Love to come down here. So, of course, the Cavaliers started to scramble to try to put something together to offer Minnesota to get Kevin Love down there. Now, this is my problem. It's almost like LeBron is trying to build another super team. The problem with that is usually a team that's in the position of the Cavaliers has to give up too many assets to send over to the other team. Right now they're talking about last year's number one, Anthony Bennett. Now they're talking about this year's number one, Andrew Wiggins, and a future number first round draft choice. That's already too much if you ask me. And if you and if, if what they're saying is that Minnesota is even driving up the price even more than what's already been been offered. Well, new coach in Minnesota, Flip Saunders, knows what type of superstar Kevin Love is, so he's going to drive up the price to make it extremely hard for another team to get him. But hey, if you ask me, Kevin Love end up going to Cleveland, it's going to turn into the same scenario that happened to LeBron in his first run in Cleveland and what just happened to him in Miami. They're going to have to gut the team of all its young, cheap, affordable talent don't build and don't uh, develop those players, and now you have one or two or three superstars on the team, and then guess what? You don't have the support to win a championship. So if you ask me, I don't like the philosophy. I would not like the move of Kevin Love to Cleveland. But hey, you know what? I think it's imminent, and it's going to happen. Stay tuned right here, and after the break, we're going to come back, and we're going to talk off the court a little bit on the court drama concerning Doc Rivers and the Los Angeles Kippers. Stay logged on right here at Blacks in Motion.